Hello, my fellow vampires! This is Malucha, and welcome back to V Rising. In the previous episode, we went after a militia captain who gave us uh, some pieces that we basically cannot craft yet. <laughs> so he gave us the Dawthorn, uh, uh, well, chest gear and leggings and gloves and boots. Uh, but we need scales for that. I've never come across scales before. Pristine leather. I have not come across pristine... We can make pristine leather, I think. And then ghost yarn. Uh, and ghost yarn is kind of locked behind. Uh, let's quickly see. Pristine leather. Yeah, we can make pristine leather with pristine hide. Yeah, no. We have not come across pristine hide yet. And uh, fish oil. So again... <sighs> We need a, a good income of, uh, well, anything related to fishes. So, uh, yeah, a bunch of resources that we have not come across yet. And if we equip our weapon and go to the Blood Altar, uh, we see Raziel the Shepherd will give us the Athenium, uh, Athenium, I think, uh, for new technology. So, again, a new means to get more research done. And Ungora the Spider Queen and... The Spider Queen has the Ghost Yarn, Silk, and the Spider Link. So we're two bosses away from actually being able to craft our gear, even. And then, uh, yeah, we still need need uh, <laughs> need to find resources that we haven't found yet. So apparently defeating enemies that we have not come across yet. And then in the smithy, we do have the... Um, is it not in the smithy? No, it's not in the smithy. It is in the new... Crafting station. So if we look on our productions, we now have an anvil uh, with a primal blood essence, 12 reinforced planks, which are no issue. We can make those. But dark silver ingots. So we need the silver ingots and we can, we do get the, we did get the recipe for dark silver ingots. But it's hell of expensive. Like we need scorch stones and silver ore. To make one dark silver ingots. Now we can make scorch stones and wood stones. I got a box full of them. So really not an issue. Glass is all a little bit. And I still need to set up a proper bone farm. To make the grave dust. Like whetstone really not an issue. We can go out farm for those. And we can get like if I go out to... Uh, what is it, the bandit strongholds. Uh, usually if I clear it once I get like two stacks. So that's really not an issue. Uh, I have not spent enough time farming quartz yet. So we definitely, I think the best location I've found so far was Downbreak Village. That has uh, four or five nodes. So definitely need to actually, well, to get some worker blood so we can get increased resources and actually start farming that up. And then Scorch Stones. Well, we can or farm them in, where was it, the Church of the Damned. Uh, one run gave us between 5 and 8, so that's not too bad either. But, yeah, actually making dark silver ingots is, is, hell, of, is hell of expensive. But yeah, for today, we are going on a search for silver ore. Because, uh, yeah, no silver ore means that we cannot actually craft up the station and craft up the weapons, right? So I am going towards my <laughs> towards my prison. So we also found at the end of the episode we found a new NPC. I'm basically recording right after the uh, the previous episode, uh, previous uh, recording session. So usually on a Sunday I record like three or four episodes in a row. Uh, it kind of makes it a little bit easier during the week for me. Uh, but yeah, we did find a hundred percent brute uh, or warrior, but we already had a warrior. So now we can actually see if we're lucky enough to get a 26% expertise uh, member or servant for ourselves. If not, then later on we're definitely gonna replace them. We're gonna keep replacing them actually. Uh, so we're gonna keep one co a coffin open and we're gonna keep replacing them till we got all of our servants need to be 26% expertise. That basically means that they're gonna be able to farm more, better and faster I think. <laughs> I'm not really sure. So for today, we are, of course, gonna take our, uh, our worker blood with us. And the least amount of stuff that I could carry. So I am gonna remove my fishing pole as well. Uh, basically, because, well, it's a silver farm. I'm not really sure. I kind of hope that it's as big as the haunted iron mine. So I definitely want to have the max amount of inventory that I can get. And the problem is, because it's going to be silver, 
Uh, we also gonna be having the issue that we need silver resistance. So we got a little bit silver resistance on our cape. Uh, so reduce damage taken from silver attacks by 7.5%. Allows you to withstand up to 12 applications of silver exposure. And I kind of wanted to test that out today as well. And I think we can actually make silver resistance brew as well. So let's quickly check that out. If we actually can. Alchemy table. So, silver resistance brew. So, we need snow flowers for those. So, that's not really too bad. Okay, let's make up two. And then uh, grab our horse. And yeah, I do presume uh, that silver is going to be found in Silverlight Hill. So that's where we are headed today. And it is kind of brown. So if we look at like this is more grasslandy with uh, white trees. This is more foresty with brown trees. We got a, a winter zone. So is this a desert zone maybe? And then yeah, we definitely have like two more locations. The Cursed Forest. Definitely haven't been there yet. And uh, yeah, a place unlocked. Um, I did hear some whispers that there apparently is going to be Yeti here or something. So is it going to be an extension of the winter biome? A bigger winter biome? I'm not sure. We'll have to see. All right, nice little stroll. So from what we can see, we got birch trees now. Birch? Birch trees, I think. Uh, a couple fish here. There as well. There as well. Is this the, like, good fishing spot? It looks more like a, um, a fall, fall type of, uh, like, I was thinking, like, desert, but it's like, yeah, like, I would say this is spring. Like, this is summer. This is spring. And then we have fall over here. And then winter over here. Roots. Oh, there are skulls. That's not good. Do we have to rush through here? Guess, guess we do. Let's check what we can find. Yo! Harpies? Okay. So we found a harpy nest. Yo! Rush more! You, you. Are they going after my horse? They're going after my horse. Damn, they hurt a lot. Yo! Army camp discovered. A bridge discovered. Okay, so mobs here are bosses or what? Level 60s. I hope they didn't kill my horse. Because they were aiming for it. The only NPC I saw... Oh no, he's still alive. How badly are you hurt? Okay, he's regening. Okay, that's good. So, level 65. 16. Oh, behind me. Yo! Holy! Crap, I'm getting holy damage here. <laughs> and fire. That's not good. We only brought a couple healing potions with us. Definitely not good. Sixty-four. Maybe our gear score is a little low for this. So let's feed and kill. Imperial thread. Oh, we found imperial thread. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah, we kind of need to kill a harpy as well. Kind of see what they drop. Go in. Smack him. Finish him off. Is this a new flower? Highland Lotus. We, we, we saw a recipe that we used that. Okay, so we got a new flower. Uh, definitely want a couple seeds from that. How high level 62. They are kind of kind of hurt though. Can I kill one? See what they drop. Okay, so they got magic on their own. Yo, 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 stop spinning. 
Okay, these harpies are crap. I pulled another one. And they're definitely interesting. Smack them back. Make them run in. Yo! It's, it's a global war here. I'm, I'm almost dead. I'm almost dead. No! What a reach! I'm almost dead, guys. Whew! Imperial Threat, Solid Hearts, Schematic. Schematic. Oh, they're for the Athenaeum. Okay, so instead of paper, more, more mob. How many mobs are there here? I need to heal. I need to heal. Okay, so we got schematics now. So it's paper scrolls and then schematics. Okay, and then Highland Lo Lotus, definitely new. Imperial Thread is new. <laughs> we were going for silver, but come on, heal, 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 heal. Yeah, I'm wasting 80% blood, I know. But I'd rather not die. There we go. More schematics. How many mobs are there here? And they do a lot of damage. Like, holy crap, do they do a lot of damage. actually not too hard to avoid just need to take your time for them 70% okay let's move to 70% that's not bad that way we can fill up again gem dust gem dust dated heart gem dust so harpies are gem dust okay Ooh. That was already uh, pretty intense. Yo! He's got specials! Holy crap! It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough fighting in this, this area. So many mobs! Yo! I got knocked off my horse! Don't kill my horse! Don't kill my horse! We got on our left here. Brighthaven Square. So this entire place is Brighthaven. It's one giant uh, castle, I think. Can we run next to it? Yes, we can. Uh, don't think cathedral. Holy crap! Yeah, it's a human city. We need to get out of here. This place is dangerous. Yo! <laughs> that that is not a place I want to go in right now. Uh, we got some gem mines there. Oh, oh! This is new. This is new. Did we find silver? Yeah, I think we found silver. Silver ore. And we are getting the debuff. Do we pay attention. Flawless sapphire. So we get the... Uh, yeah, these are the oh, 64 gem dust. So yeah, it's going to be easier getting the gem dust. Uh, simply because... Well, we are getting in the zone where we can get flawless. Like the third tier of gems. And then we have 49 silver ore. And we have... Three sickness, which is not damaging us right now. So I kind of wonder if it's by means of three. So 30 is one. Let's quickly check. If we would split... Let's do something like this. 35. If we drop these. Two, one. Yeah. So it goes by 30, I think. So if we take 60... Can we take 60? 71. So we should drop to 2. Yeah, so it goes by 30. Every 30 uh, silver you've got in yourself, you actually take uh, 1 debuff. Okay, pretty interesting. What do we got here? Sacred silver mine. So an army camp, sacred silver mine, guys. So this entire place is a silver mine. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's see if we can get, find a side entrance. Stay out of the sun a little bit. Because that main entrance was rather properly protected. Yeah, 
Yeah, they are. They are attacking my Rushmore. Stay, stay there, stay there. Silver mine, guys. We found it. I rediscovered sacred silver mine. Okay, let's drink. Uh, let's heal up. Let's drink our worker blood. Eh, do we wanna? Yeah, let's drink it. More silver, right? That's why we're here. 64. Let's try not to take damage as much as possible. Let's knock him back. Try to Probably gonna be a feed boss in here as well. Yo, 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 yo. He's taking a lot of damage. Can we not avoid that? I have a feeling that there's gonna be a lot of mobs in here. Strength, let's get our max health up. He's healing himself. Another one of those guys. Feet. Let's kill him. Schematics. Okay. Bunch of urns. Fish oil. Sulfur ore. A lot of sulfur. We got a, we found a church. More sulfur. Yeah, look at that flawless topazes. Yeah, that's really good. So we're going into the next tier of uh, games. That is really cool. That is really cool. Let's break everything down. More silver ore. So you can find silver ore in the bases as well. Okay, let's continue. I have a feeling that there's gonna be a V blood here as well. Rifleman, rifleman, knight. Smack him back. Whoa, there were some good hits. Can we heal? Yeah, if we take it slowly, we should be able to do this. Beat, kill, smack him. It drops schematics, nice. Imperial Treads, definitely want to pick that up as well. Yeah, we're gonna be really quickly through our... Uh, through our blood, because we basically constantly heal off of it. Didn't see any... Oh, that's the first one. Again, more. Let's uh, drink that resistance. There we go. That way we can carry a little bit more before we start taking damage, right? Warrior. Rifleman. Rifleman. Warrior. Definitely a lot of enemies here. Holy crap. I missed everything. <laughs> they do a lot of damage. They do a lot of damage and they have slows. I'm I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm gonna die here. I can't dodge out. Let's do it like this. Can I not eat of you yet? Let's feed. Let's feed! Get a little bit better blood. It's a little bit better. Ooh. Flawless ruby. Nice. I don't see a lot of... Like, silver veins, though. Oh, did we find one? So that's the second one that we found inside here. Yeah, that's not good. That really isn't good. And we lost our worker blood as well. 
Let's go here. Yo! Wasn't what I wanted to do. And let's knock him back in. Beat and kill. Knock back. And kill before he could kill me. Nice. A lot of rubies. Uh, not a lot of flawless, I mean. And this is the way we came, right? And this is the way we came. So there wasn't any pain here. Okay, let's move forward. And that is the entrance. So the only place we have left. Yeah, that's basically the outside. Okay, we find another one. Nice. So they stack at 100. The silver ore. How much do we actually have? Let's put thread here. Sort. One, two, three, four, five. 500. We can carry footman, rifleman, knights. Okay. No V bloods. Okay, better blood. I wonder if they can actually interrupt this. Yo, jewelry, nice. And now we are seeing a couple veins. Now we are seeing a couple veins. Okay. Yeah, I think on the room on the right here. It's gonna be a fee blood. We're we gonna check who we can find here. Footman. Yeah, there's gonna cleric. I don't really see properly. Schematic. So cleric. Bad bomber, thrower, guard. Don't really want to pull. Do want a cleric, 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 footman. Don't see any V bullet though. Don't see any veins either. Yeah, only a chest. Why is this room here? It's not for a V blood. Yo! That was dangerous. You stupid bastard. Silver ore, we have four planks. Got two more nodes here. And we are increasing our silver capacity. Starting to take damage to the point that we can't out heal it. I think so. Let's pick 90, 91, 98. Yeah, we are starting to take damage. Let's sort. What's the max amount I can carry without decreasing my HP? So 4, 2, 3, 4, 3, 4, 3, 4. So with. Uh, 30 silver resistance, you can carry 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1,025 is the amount you can carry without actually... Am I healing 7, 7, 6, 7, 6, 8, 7? So I'm healing a little bit now. Okay, that's good to know. And uh, we got one more uh, vein here. And then we ran through one more vein here. So I think in total uh, you can get, let's say, 13, 14 stacks. 14 stacks, around 14 stacks from one run. That would mean that you would need at least 45 silver resistance to actually make a proper farm here.
Yeah, we uh, got our farm, guys. Let's head out. Let's head back. And let's make some silver and see if we can actually already make a couple weapons. And we need... How many? 32 for the dark silver for the anvil. Uh, so... We can actually next time make the the dark silver. I uh, will make the anvil, uh, so we can craft that up, and then we're gonna see uh, what else the weapons require. But for this episode, it's just gonna be uh, well an exploration uh, episode. Me trying to find silver, and uh, my journey through well silver light high hills. Uh, it was, it's definitely a zone I need to. I, before I actually go venture and farm in this, I definitely need to go to the new armor uh, as well. But to go to the new armor, we still need to beat a couple, well, a couple of V-bosses. But next episode, probably we can actually increase our weapons at least uh, for, for now. And then armor will come later. Anyway, guys, if you want to see more of my Let's Play here in V Rising or any other game I might play on my channel, just hit that subscribe button. It would always help out a lot. I do hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.